Hello. Believe it or not, I I do brush the hair, but dude, with everything I'm doing with in here, and as long as my hair is, the clip, it gets all messed up in the clip. And like when I film, I make sure I'm resting. I'm not, there's no reason to do a presentation and stand and do any sort of theatrics, or you know what I mean? That sort of stuff right now, no. Um, I did all the dishes. I made sure I, I got my food. Mommy's got her food going. I got quesadillas coming up, all that with the Mexican and the cheddar cheese. And I got it planned out. Mommy's gonna keep fed. Um, I'm sleeping in here because I secure my room so I know I can, or it's, it's, I feel, you know, it's one of those psychological things I feel. And I get my green lights, I get my guidance. Go to sleep, mommy, you're okay. The drug use last night was a little bit alarming because they're fucking people inebriated in here again. You don't want that, especially when they're fucking violent and dangerous. Like they are here and they've proven that. I don't need to argue this case anymore. The last thing I want is them high on drugs. So this shit was coming into my room oh, forever for like halfway through the debate. Um, that fucking shit was coming. I don't know what she's doing. She's fucking out of her mind. Okay. She's a mental case and a violent, dangerous criminal. So, wow, yeah. But I'm not really scared of her. What was alarming to me was all the people she was bringing in here. And that dates, the dates I put up with all the folks that were here during those days. That I knew to stay clear from staying here. Don't even, don't even get in that mix, mommy. Stay in here. Which I did. Um, all right, so... I'm going to try to call Philly tomorrow. I've got this massive database. Basically, is my best words for it right now with my word recall. Um, it was worth it. It's a way to cut through brokers. You still get some brokers, but it's a great way on the East Coast, one of these things, to try to navigate rentals because it's madness. And we are also in the fall of Rome. So having said all that, I could just do my best daily effort. We'll see what happens. Um... I strongly theorize that Iran could strike us at any point. I might not really be moving to Philly because Iran might attack our country. It could change everything, right? We'll have to reevaluate that when it happens, if it does, which I, I see it going that way. I'll be surprised if Iran doesn't attack us. I'll be surprised. I don't want America to be attacked, but look, if they do it, use it for our best. Rebuild, learn from our lessons. This white nationalism hooking up with the fucking Al-Qaeda is where it got us. Looks where it got us. It got us attacked. Rebuild. Fix it. Remove the people who were part of that overthrow movement. Remove them off our city streets so the rest of the people can walk safely. Take all the little access to guns away. That'll teach us here. No more Second Amendment. You don't need that. No, you don't. It's not a God-given right to go get a lethal weapon. No. And um, so that's it. I just wanted to say that I'm okay. I'm here with the cats. Miggy and Baby have good health. I have good health. I'm sleeping, eating, doing my nails. What else? What the fuck else? I'm doing it all. I'm trying. I'm trying to do it all that I can with the environmental noise, coping with my environment, staying sober. Of course, that's just a given. And when I have to, I do my meditational breathing. Thank God for that sound machine. And thank God for salsa. Don't forget the salsa got me through before the sound machine. We should try some of that, but not with these fucking criminals here. There's not time for musica. Not time for musica. All right, God bless America. Say goodbye.